Sometimes life is more scary than the paranormal or the fiction. Sometimes there are just crazy things that happen that are truly terrifying. Today I'm going to be showing you six clips where life got really scary. This video is brought to us by TikTok user AccuWeather, and in this video we have somebody who's trying to drive in a parking lot while it's flooding. And now you think to yourself, well what could go wrong here? Parking lots have parameters. Well, a lot can go wrong, especially that parking lot borders on a river or canal. In this clip we have somebody who has a bird's eye view from a building when they happen to be filming this car trying to fight its way through the waterlogged parking lot. Unfortunately for this car, it doesn't know exactly where the parking lot ends and the water for the river begins. And as you can see here, they take a turn, and they take their risk as they get closer up ahead, and they went over. Now, this girl is extremely lucky that she was able to get out and get to a safe point, because she could have gone all the way under, and she could have been swept against the current and trapped underneath there. That car, I, I would not try and drive a sedan through that. I really would not. What are they going to do? Oh, no way. What are you doing? You're literally driving right into it. What are you doing? What is this person doing? What is the creek? What are you're driving into the creek? No, 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 no. Stop! No. Stop! No, no, no! Okay, that got bad very quickly. Uh should we go down down there and help? So uh good news the girl is okay. She is out of her car. Uh and there are some people walking over to help her right now. So uh she is okay. That is the important part. Her car, uh, maybe not so much, but the girl is okay. Number two. This video is brought to us by TikTok user Cprint. In this video, we have what seems to be a nightmarish scene right out of Final Destination. This van was traveling behind a logging truck, and one of the lower logs became dislodged and went through his windshield. Now, a lot of people won't get behind logging trucks just because of that movie. But here's more proof that you shouldn't do it. This happened in real life. And truly, I don't know how I'd react to this. I'd probably scream and then I'd slam the brakes. He's lucky this thing didn't kill him and or crush him. He's going to need some safe light repair after this. What are the odds, though? I mean, yeah, anything's probable. But again, the fact of the matter that this actually happened, just like the scene in the movie, it's terrifying. But yeah, that's, uh, that's really about it for this one. What do you guys think? You ever seen something like this before that wasn't in Final Destination? And with savings that fit right into her budget. This shit crazy, boy. USAA.com. Final destination. USAA. Yeah, literally. We're made for. Right here. I don't watch that movie now. Number three. This video is brought to us by TikTok user Wes Marsh. And in this video, we have somebody who has a flamethrower and they're attempting to burn somebody who was sleeping with their significant other. Yes, this man was literally playing with fire. When you decide to wreck a home, you have no idea for the terms and conditions you're signing up for. This guy's lucky he got away. This could have ended really badly. You gotta give this guy props though, a homemade flamethrower. In this economy? So take this as a lesson. If you're doing something questionable with somebody you shouldn't be, maybe this is a good time to stop. Regardless, I'm not here to tell you how to live your life. Yo, look, 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 yo, 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 bro, 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 no, no, no. Yo, nah, son got a flamethrower, bro. Nah, yo. Nah, what the fuck? You about to burn her, bro? Yo, what the? I ain't never seen no shit like this, bro. Nah, what the fuck, bro? Son. Yo, son of a bitch, bro. <laughs> yo, what the fuck? Nah, nah, she should leave that nigga, yo. What the fuck you get some shit like that for? This video is brought to us by TikTok user The Grave Digger. Now this is a video that's a bunch of videos that are compiled together from different TikTok users that are showing there's strange happenings going on with their food. Be it the food seems fake or somewhat plastic or just lab created. I mean, some of these things you see and you're just like, huh. It's no surprise that a lot of the food in America is poisoned and as these big companies cut corners and replace actual nutrients with sawdust and fillers and chemicals, it just makes you wonder, how much of what we're actually eating is actually food? Because at this point, it just seems like it's more plastic than food. So has this happened to you? Have you got any doughy bananas or flimsy watermelons or rubbery avocados? Makes you wonder, how much fake food sold around America? I'm sure the number's a lot higher than you think. Somebody tell me what's going on at Coke. This is the third six pack that I've gotten that does this. They're, they're not carbonated and they're, they're flat. 
Like, if I wanted Pepsi, I would have bought Pepsi. What is happening? Sauce should not do that. My radish was moving like that. Do you see that? What is that? First of all, I soaked this meat in a vinegar and yes, it changed color. Like it went from pink to brown. So I was like, okay, maybe it's just the vinegar that got in there. But why is this beef holographic? Anybody ever seen an asparagus like this? Check this out. Fresh out the box. Look at this. What the hell happened it's to like this guy? This. I have never seen an asparagus like that before in my Dog, so this used to be an apple. What the fuck is this? This was an apple. Look at the stem. I could be wrong, but I was under the impression that ice cream would melt after sitting out all night. Now it looks like somebody shit in my sink that had really bad diarrhea from Taco Bell or maybe White Castle. They are selling fake avocados in Texas. This video is brought to us by TikTok user Bodycam, and in this video we have a cop who is investigating a person's car after a traffic stop when they come across a pipe bomb that goes off in their personal vicinity. I will state now that nobody was unalive during this event, but it does throw the cop off guard. I mean, when you're shifting through someone's stuff and something explodes on you, that's definitely something unexpected. Although we have no idea what this guy was going to be doing with this pipe bomb, it's a good thing the cop caught him and stopped him, and unfortunately, even though it did blow up on the cop, at least nobody was harmed during this video. At least not majorly harmed, if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, you ever seen anything crazy like this before? There's a lot of crazy police body cam footage, but this one, this took the cake for me. It's dragged out, but the explosion's right here. Just remember the next time you're driving, you never know what people are carrying in their car. There's your weed. Listen, man, is there any meth in here? Just be no, real with no. me, brother. I'm, I'm serious as hurt, Jake. No, Listen, this is a meth pipe, okay? Yeah. There's methamphetamine in that, okay? So if you would just be honest with me, you, I will help you out. I, I, but if you do not be honest, man, I ain't being totally honest. you're not. not playing with you guys. There's no meth in there. When was the last time you smoked meth? Yes, sir. I'll be honest. Is there any chance I'm gonna find meth in this car? No, there is. Are you sure? Yes. How sure are you? Very sure. All right. Well. I wouldn't have nothing like that in the car. Mr. Price, the pipe is in there. So you smoked methamphetamine yesterday. You use any other kind of drugs? Yeah, it's it's good. Whoa! What the fuck? Number six. This video is brought to us by TikTok user Lost Places, and in this video we have a group of kids who are exploring an abandoned hotel, and during their explanation they come across two of the scariest things you can find. One, still water, which if you don't know about urban explanation, you should look it up. Still water is something you don't want to come across, and two, it looks to be a body. Now, we're not certain that this is a body because the camera cuts away so quick, but it almost looks like someone's leg floating in that still water. I've looped the clip a couple of times and slowed it down, but it's tough to say for certain what we're looking at here. If it's not a body, then what could it be? Why would somebody go out of their way to wrap something up like that and throw that in standing water like that in the bottom of an abandoned hotel? It leaves more questions than answers when you really get down to it, but it's an interesting clip nonetheless. A new emotion! Wow! 
you have it, my spooky friends. Sometimes we take a real-life approach when it comes to horror. It doesn't always have to be cryptids, ghosts, and monsters. Regardless, I hope you enjoyed today's content. If you like this kind of content, maybe I'll make more of it. Let me know in the comment section down below. Regardless, thank you for watching, and I'll scare you in the next one.